Let me tell y'all dumb ass niggas, man. Listen, bro. If you got to brag about how much money you getting, how much money you have, all right? Your Fendi, your, your Pradas, your, your Ferragamo, you know, Balenciaga, all of this shit that don't mean nothing, all right? All that shit cotton, all right? But you want to argue with me or somebody like me about all of the shit that you didn't attain that you thought that meant something. That supposed to give you some type of greater value or some shit, right? Like Biggie did. Biggie did that, right? He hated himself. He loved and hated himself. Black and ugly as ever. However, I stay Coogee down to the socks. So the shit that you wear has more value than the actual body or person that you put in these things on. But this is my point. Why the fuck are we paying for the shit that we was picking in them fields? All of the clothes and shit should be free to black people. Do you understand how stupid, like I'm from, you know, uh, you know, uh, Pittsburgh or something, St stupid, you, you, an idiot, it's just stupid, four-year-old, three-year-olds out there picking cotton, big-ass sacks of cotton, to the point where and you can go get this out of uh, putting, old, put, putting on for old master. That they were hanging their children in the trees from sun up to sun down because they had to work for master to go and pick up. I mean, to go pick cotton all fucking day. Set their kids down going hungry. That literally this black woman had to nurse this Caucasian child on her breast while the child that she gave birth to go hungry or eat slop. What is the problem with this? What is wrong with you? What is wrong with your mind? Listen, man, and all you're getting, get knowledge yourself, man. You need to know who you are, man. They're erasing everything about you. And you falling for it because you don't stand for nothing. You won't read. You want to sit up and watch propaganda all day. All you do is sit on YouTube and watch videos all fucking day. You want to talk about the Anunnaki. You want to talk about the reptilians. You motherfuckers want to talk about everything that is detrimental to you and your life. Everything that is about whitewashing and blacking out all of your history and everything that, uh, that consists of you, your family, your ancestors, and who your children are going to be. Get knowledge yourself, man, so you can free your motherfucking mind, man. Free up your life. We know about this power structure and the system that we live in. We understand it, right? It just happens, you know, so to be that we living in this particular type of system and it's being ruled by your reptilians. It ain't got shit to do with no motherfucking shape-shifting people, man. It is the character, okay? The snake shit that they're doing. When they shape-shift, they'll be your friend, and next thing you know, they Judas. Right? They'll be all for Black Lives Matter, and then they own some shit about black lives or all lives matter. As if they don't understand what the point is. Nobody said that just black lives matter. We just said that they matter as well as any other life on this planet. Get your shit together, man. You're only destroying yourself. And it's no different than uh, African slaves and uh, Indian masters. It was big business for them, right? They saw, right? And you can go get the book. They saw that it was going to be, uh, they could generate wealth by putting us into slavery like the Caucasian did.
though we've been through four types of slavery. But you know what happened after, right? Yeah. They turned on them and they fucking murdered the shit out of them. It was It's already crazy that Cortez already had in, uh, the first European to step foot on this continent continent back in like the 1500s, like 15 something, 1549 or something like that. Don't quote me on the numbers, but I'm writing exact about that, All right? Columbus never discovered the new world. That nigga ended up in the Caribs, which is today known as the Caribbeans. But this is the problem. You don't know your history. And then getting this type of information, they can't dupe you into believing anything. You knew, you knew motherfuckers, y'all don't stand for nothing, man. So they can make all of these new videos, put all of these bullshit. You, you don't read books. We just going to put that out there. I was going to say these new books, but you don't read the books. The books you're going to read is, you know, your Zachariah Stitchin and your David Ickes and shit like that. You're not going to read nothing that there's no Ronoko Rashidis, no Ivan Van Sertimans, John Henry Clark. You're not going to read none of that shit. Because it ain't helping your bullshit ideology or your fucked up, twisted, perverted imagination. That's the gist of it. And gist, G-Y-S-T, is get your shit together.